Welcome back to the Battlefield Mech Warriors. I'm Nightshade, and this is Rogue Tech. So we're going to change it up a little bit and play some uh, Battletech. I played this game back in uh, 2018 when it first came out for about 20 or 30 hours, and that's it. Um, so this is going to be kind of a learning, learning experience for everybody. So in the comments, if you guys have any suggestions or anything that I do wrong or anything like that that could make it better, um, please sound off in the comments because I'm going to make a lot of mistakes. Um, but with that said, um, when I started this channel um, back in uh, November, um, I had all intentions of doing uh, everything Battletech. Well, everything PC Battletech. So like MechWarrior 5 I started with, and then this game I was going to play, and then the other game I want I really, really want to get into is MechWarrior Online. I, I think that would be really fun. And I think it'd be really fun to stream. So I am going to do that eventually, uh, just not sure when. Um, but this is the next one in line. Also, it kind of plays to my ADHD a little bit. I can't, um, I have a really, really hard time sticking to one game. And so this will allow me to, um, this will allow me to uh, play a different game now um, for a little bit. And um, because I like modded stuff and, you know, usually mods for me make, uh, make games a lot better. So with that said, um, we're going to start a new career in Rogue Tech today. Rogue Tech is a, a major, major overhaul. Like I, I think there's almost as much, uh, 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 data in the Rogue Tech as there is in, um, the actual game. There might even be more actually. But anyway, regardless, it is really big. Um, I would like to do a uh, 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 a video on you know how to install and all that stuff for for people that uh, for people that don't know. There's plenty of there's a couple of good videos out there, but I would like to do one myself because I just I like to do it. Uh, plus, it gives people more more of a chance to find something. Um, but um, I have been watching videos for the last few days, um, trying to figure some stuff out. Um, there's a there's a dude, uh, Two Techie, I think is what he goes by, and um, he has a really good series on it. It's from more than a year ago, some of it is, but um, it's still very relevant and really good. I'll leave a I'll leave a a a, a, a link to the to the thing down at the bottom to his vid set of videos for this down at the bottom if you want if you really want to learn about road tech um that's that's where to go i think i might because um he hasn't posted anything more than five months i might start a series that's similar to that once i learn it a little bit but anyway regardless let's get on with this so uh this allows you to like pretty much like even when you first start road tech when you come up with the uh launcher um you have a lot of settings to to make the game the way you want it. So we've already set those. Um, and I, again, I will go through that um, a little bit at a, at a different time. But for now, this is setting up a playthrough. So um, I was suggested when I was when I was watching those videos and stuff to um, these are the settings. So do most of it default and then put a couple of things that make it a little bit easier. So you also get to pick a company type and you can look it up in a wiki and what it does is is like these are your starting mechs or starting vehicles or starting whatever your starting equipment is um this pretty much tells you what it is i am just going to go with a merrick start today uh okay and then we'll leave friendly fire on um all this stuff we're just going to leave as default for the most part the only thing I'm going to change is normal. We're going to start. Uh, we're going to change our starting C bills. It just will give me a little bit of a buffer if I mess up in the first couple of missions or whatever, so that I can get my mechs uh, up and running again without too much of a problem. And then this is going. I'm going to bump this up just two percent to fifteen. And everything else is going to say uh, stay default. So, all right. And I'm going to go ahead and start the game. I'll be right back. And we're back. So, um, what we're going to do here is uh, create our character. Um, there will be one more cut uh, between this and uh, 
the next section again there's a bunch of load time again it, it's the the mod is huge it's ginormous um but with that said let's go ahead and uh, create our character so I already picked the portrait that I want to do. I want to kind of go for a, uh, like I've been looking at this for the last few days, so I kind of under, like this is like relatively familiar for me. So, um, but I kind of want to go with like a British accent. So there's actually a British right. accent on here. I hear ya. Yeah. Oh. yeah, so I want to go with a uh, British accent. This is it right here, okay. And then let's come up with a call sign, thud, bull. Beetle, poker, <laughs> shiv. Let's try a few more and slack or peanut butter. <laughs> Looking for like a, uh, actually cherry bomb. We're going with cherry bomb. <laughs> cherry bomb. I don't like Janet. What's a kind of a, a good, yeah, we'll go with Abigail Bailey. Yeah, I like it. Abigail Bailey. Abigail and Bailey. Okay. And I, yeah, I think this is our I think this is our girl. So save. All right. And now we get to uh, pick our um, our stats, our background stats. So um, you have just like in Mech Warrior, um, you have gunnery, pilot, tactics, and guts. And so we are going to pick these. And in this game, uh, from my understanding, when you first start, you can't hit the broad side of a barn. So you want to go for everything you can to be able to hit. One of the ways to do that is get tactics because tactics give you um, give you uh, sensor. Uh, it allow it, it makes your sensors better or get some back up to normal something i can't remember what it does but i know that it helps with your sensors and so that if you don't have um sensor range to see them then uh you take a big hit in uh accuracy so what we're going to do is we're going to do we're going to go with deep periphery and get two gunnery and then we'll be able to add uh, when we start the game. She'll start with our commander starts with uh, with experience points, and we'll be able to add those and then get that our tactics up to four. So we're going to start off with a gunnery of four and tactics of four. Okay, and then gambling, and then these are um, these are just again more um, more stat uh, background or quirks. So there's a lot of quirks you can get, and um, Lucky allows you to, um, like helps with jamming and stuff like that. Uh, we are going to go with technology. Uh, so you're able to use uh, lost tech and, and then technician actually helps you reduce the amount of time that you're in a mech bay. Okay. And then... What these do is on top of the mechs and equipment you already get, um, you can um, you choose your career that you had before becoming the commander of the Argos. And uh, so this allows you to have a little bit more equipment or a little bit more money or a little better stats. Um, there is one that I would like to try eventually. Is it this one? No. Um, oh no, up here that I would like to try eventually um, is the, where's it at? Freeborn. No, not Freeborn. Um, Trueborn. And you get plus one to all skills, but you can't command vehicles. And I would like to command vehicles. So we're going to go with that. And then I'm thinking... Um, so this is more of a, if, if you run with this, you're running with more of a, um, uh, like a melee mech. And that sounds fun, but I think for the time being, what I want to do is this, there is a, yeah, command commando veteran. And so you get ex-military, which helps with uh, your offense, your accuracy 
and uh, it, it helps manage like high recoil weapons, so like ballistic weapons. And so, and you get a bushwhacker. And bushwhackers in this game are really good. It, most of the variants are good, from my understanding. All right, we're going to confirm this, and then uh, once the game gets in, I'll, I'll be back. Okay. All right, and we're back. And uh, come to find out, I hit, it only took, like, I, I hit the stop button to stop recording, and it only took, uh, it only took, took a couple of seconds, actually. So you only have that one initial uh, um, uh, spin up, uh, you know, load. But anyway, with that said, uh, let's move on. So, um, yeah, so we're starting a new career. Uh, there's a few things that you got to do before you do it. So the first thing we want to do is look at our mechs. Check out this mech bay, Commander. Pretty great, right? Um, you set up like this, there's nothing I can do. Hey, I haven't played this game in such a long time. I don't even know if these are good or not. I'm sure they are. We're going to set these up like this. I mean, this has S, E, and A on it. That's got to be good, right? Let's look at it. Uh, I mean, that's actually, uh, that looks really good. I mean, from the beginning. I mean, I think that's pretty good. And then, let's see. Let's look at these, refit. We probably want to change a few things around. Okay, so what does this do actually? Jump jets are nice. Large pulse, medium. Wouldn't mind having more armor in there. Actually, you know, it'd be really nice. So this has three lasers total, but it can have five. How much damage does that do? Seven tons, it does 57 damage. Twenty-seven. Yeah, I think um, so. Having yeah, I think actually putting uh, all medium pulse lasers on there instead of the one large one would be really nice. And then maybe get rid of the jump jets for armor. Actually, I think I'm going to do that anyway. Yeah, let's get rid of these jump jets for armor. I think I'd rather have armor right now than be able to jump around the field. And this mech is relatively mobile anyway. Yeah. Let's do this. Max armor. Yeah, I like it. Uh, let's do... Let's take a little bit of back armor off. Oops. Try to take the do that. that. Now this does look like a mech that you want to have some back armor on because it's going to be moving in and out. Um, then we'll take that. Yeah. Uh, now we'll take. We'll do that. Yeah. All right. I like it. Uh, Actually, you know what, before we do that, I'll come back and do it. We should look at the store first to see if there's anything, because we don't have... Okay, I, I gotta figure out what I'm doing. Okay, so if we go to the mech bay, hey, Commander. Be with we got his components. All right, yeah, we don't have any, that's what I thought. And do we have any tanks or anything? Because sometimes you'll get tanks. I forget. Is it, yeah, vehicle base. All right, so we don't have any of that, and we don't have any battle armor. We're definitely not going to have any super. Okay, yeah. All right, so yeah, let's go look at the store real quick. Okay, so weapons. What kind of weapons are we looking at? Uh, well, that looks good. Uh, that is an extended range LRM. I think I want that. 
but we'll wait. So we got all those. We definitely don't want to do these quick sell things. And I think a regular large laser and a medium laser is fine. So any ammo. I know ammo is a big deal in this, especially in the road tech. <clears throat> and then I think I think I remember watching some of the videos I was watching. I think these are really good too. Again, anybody that actually watches this, uh, chime out if you know what you're doing, because I have absolutely no clue what I'm doing other than the little bit of videos that I watched. All right, so, and then we're definitely not gonna be able to get any mechs. So, weapons, ammo, equipment. I mean, these are good in the other game. I wouldn't mind having that. Okay, so there, okay. So now let's go look at the mechs. All right, so we kind of know what we want to do. We, we want to do with that one. This one, what do we got going on here? Oh, look. How many spots is that? I don't know. Can we fit another ELRM 15 on there? No, right? My other problem is, is like, I like, I kind of don't know. Oh, and I don't know where to put myself yet. Where do I put myself? To not cover stuff up. Maybe up here for now. Cover up the money a little bit, but I mean, yeah, I, I, I don't know. We'll have to figure that out as we go. Uh, yeah, it doesn't look like movement we got four okay so he doesn't have really good movement anyway and I really wouldn't mind if we took because I feel that we could take these off these are one tons and put this ammo down in the legs does it work different in this game than it does in like um, other like well mech warrior 5 where it's better to have the uh, ammo in the legs I know that like if you take damage in the arm and it goes over, it spills over into the torso, or sorry, into the shoulder. And then if you take damage in the shoulder and it exceeds the value, it will spill over into the uh, the torso. I don't know how the legs work exactly, if they spill over or not. Okay, so I wonder, so let's, let's take that off because we'll just put it back. Just curious how much weight we're working with. All right, can we get any other weight off? I mean, the heat efficiency goes way up, so we might be able to take, can we take one of those off? Or no, no, we can't, we can't, right? Yeah, you got, okay. Just like in any other Battletech game. Um, so those will have to go there, engine. Okay, that's got to be part of the XL. All right, so we, are, let's see, five. So that's seven tons. How much is this? Oh no, we'll have to look for something smaller. So let's go ahead and revert that back. All right, so this is good for now. Um, I do want to change that other one for sure. Yeah. Okay, and then we also don't forget we have a uh, a bushwhacker, but you have to um, with the way that they did um, with the way that from from the way it was explained um, that I understand it. They have oh that looks like an archer actually is that I mean it says Apollo but is that an archer? That looks like an archer. That's interesting. But anyway, sorry. Um, I, uh, from the way it was explained and I understood it was, um, you can't get that extra because like the, it, it's the career that we took. We're going to get a bushwhacker 
but we have to, um, it's kind of a gift thing. So we have to um, forward the time one day, but we kind of don't want to waste a day because we're limited on funds to begin with. And I really want to, um, like, I want to, I want to do the best I can. So, so we got to make some work happen that between that and then the engineering base. So, all right. So the Apollo is going to stay like it is. Refit. What about this one? Oh, wow. I like this one. This has got a bunch of uh, energy hard points. And we just got a bunch of en energy. We got guard. So this thing is made to go up and like just really. All right. I think if I remember correctly that this doesn't really do anything without. Yeah, 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 yeah. Look, so you got to have a C3 master to operate. And I don't think we do. So that's a ton we could take out, but I don't know what we would put in in its place. Armor. We would definitely put armor in its place. You know what? I think what I'm going to do is... Because this one's pretty good as it is. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this out. And again, let me know in the comments if I'm just completely screwing up my mech um, and I'm going to take this out and the reason that I'm going to do that is uh, we still have um, six other lasers um, this is not adding I mean it adds some damage but it's not like um, I feel that with the heat management anyway because look at the heat efficiency I feel that we're going to have um, we're not going to be able to fire these all these lasers every every round anyway so taking this off is not gonna like actually pull its uh, damage down much. But what we could do now is up the armor. Yeah, and that's a lot more respectable. I wish we could get another ton off. I'm not taking another laser off. That thing is fast as I'll get out. Do we need that mask? And then it also does, uh, it damages and crits the legs on failure. What's the failure rate? 5% base failure chance on activation and each turn until deactivated. Plus 15% additional failure chance on consecutive turns. So you definitely don't want to use that on consecutive turns. But if you're trying to get away, get around, that's plus 50% run, run multiplier. So that would be... Oh wow, yeah, that would be a lot actually. Oh, especially if you're sprinting. Holy moly. And then you would deactivate it. Um, and from my understanding and what I remember is you uh, the more you move, the more evasion you have. So this thing's going to have a crap ton of evasion. So we definitely want to think about that with the pilot. And then with this handheld slot, we could actually probably uh, put... Well, no, not with those. Because eh. you can't punch and use your uh, your arm uh, weapons in the same round. Which makes sense. So, yeah, I think I'm going to go with this for now. Yeah. So, we're going to validate that. Confirm. Oh, and then... Nice let's look at this guy. He's also got a mask. ER medium laser, ER small laser, ER medium. Oh, this is another one I wouldn't mind just having all, because he's going to be dodging in and out of way. Anyway, look at his speed. So we could put all small lasers in there. With that, how much would that bring the damage down, or would it be relatively neutral? Actually, think it would be okay. So it's 15. So you would have four of these. Four at 15 is 60, and then this is 25, 50. 
So you would lose out on five points of damage. But you would have more hits. I don't know which one would be better. But we're definitely going to leave it as is for right now. So. Alright. And then. Alright, so. It, was it this one we were going to change? Yeah. All right, so do that. Yeah, I'd much rather have extra armor than these jump jets for now. Just until I learn the game a little bit better. Like, you know, and I play, like you guys have seen me play Mech Warrior, like I'm all about the defense. All right, so we're good there. Um, do we want... Yeah, you know what? Let's take like we did before. Um, take what one down there, and yeah, we'll take two. That's good. All right, so validate. That's seventeen days, which is fine. Right. I'll okay. get the schedule. And then, the, so then we got to do, let's look at our pilots. All right, there's our regular, our uh, main, our commander. Deadlock, military gladiator, mech warrior. And these are also, I think that there are, so the purple ones are, oh God, what are they called? Um, they're like, uh, they're, they are pilots you can't change. Yes, Commander. Um, like, so, we ha oh, we, oh, we have all, all of these purple. So, they usually have, the purple ones, usually have more, um, more quirks to them. And then they, uh, but what you can't do is you can't customize. You can't change the picture or anything like that. So, and then there's the blue, um, things, and those are, uh, kick kickstarters so they're the ones that like put up a bunch of money with uh with them to begin with and then the other ones are i can't remember what the other there's another one too but i don't remember oh i think each of the uh people that actually work on um work on uh rogue tech are in here as well so all right so with that said um we are Standing by. All right. So deadlock. Waiting for orders. Looks okay. Receiving you. All right. I think what I want to do with her is go ahead and do this, and then I'm gonna do that. That's the reason we took plus two points instead of plus one and plus one, so that we could spread those points out a little bit more. And I think that's what I want to do. Yeah. Training okay. complete. And then deadlock. I'm here. I don't know what I want to do with her yet, so we're going to wait. We're not going to spend her points. Good to go. Decker. Yeah, see, had I done what I was talking about doing, we would have had a point here and a point here, and then um, and then it just takes more points. So I saved a few uh, XP by doing it the way I did it. And I think that's the way we're going to do Decker as well. He, what is it? He's got a commander. Commander's really good. Officer's really good, too. Actually, that's really good. I'm gonna, I'm definitely gonna use him. All right, and then Hightail, Commander. Man, there's a lot of commanders in here. I was hoping for some more technicians. They help with these scores over here, and the higher score mech tech score you have, it takes less time to get your uh, fit your mechs repaired or refit. All right, and then we got Mando. Aye, <laughs> That's aye. funny. Another commander. Holy moly. We are swimming in commanders. Ready for nice. orders. Phoenix. We might just be keeping him on hand to uh, help out with... Because uh, it's got Noble, so it reduces the upkeep keep of uh, the morale and med upgrades. Okay. And then, commander? Is it Rafer? 
gladiator, brave. So not too bad either. And then cigar. Oh, another commander and officer. Okay. So I think I'm here. I think I want to put her in. She's got piloting. We could turn her into a uh, melee mech, mech pilot. All right, again, we'll we'll wait for a second until we actually about to drop. All right, so then engineering. Welcome to engineering, Commander. So most of these things they hinge at you. Ha you almost have to do that one first. But what I want to do is I want to get I want to do this so it gives us plus one tech points, Roger which will commander. help out over the there. Moving. And then it will also allow us to have a second mech bay. Right now we can only repair and re or refit a one mech at a time. Re repair and refit one mech at a time. And then um, I really want to get this training module because it gives pilots 30 experience points per day. So that, that's like while we're traveling or when we jump in and the pilot's not doing anything, as long as they're not injured, they're receiving uh, experience every day. So it'll, it'll help level our uh, pilots up some, especially ones we're not using. Okay, so, so that's that. So I think I'm gonna do that one second and then this one third all right I'm just making sure that i'm oh uh are there any pilots that we want to hire uh hunter I mean, pilot upkeep is really nice it's good to go Ooh. I think I kind of want to buy him. 10% chance to steal a thousand sea bills from, from or for you. That's really funny. Um, he's got a merchant, and then he's also noble. Disgraced is actually really good. You got to make sure your morale is not bad. But yeah, I'm buying. I'm getting him. New mech warriors available. Then, so we got all that. I think I do actually want to. Um, the, I think I do actually want to go ahead and buy this ELRM. Like we won't be able to use it on that one mech, but uh. New weapon systems available. going to buy any ammo because I don't really know what um, I think I want to buy these two things right here before we leave but we're going to wait so what we're going to do now is now that we're not wasting time we are going to go we're going to fast forward a day yep and this is going to get okay yep and then now what kind of missile boat in the mud. Okay, it says it's a missile boat. I, I wasn't paying attention. What uh let's see, P1? It's I don't even know if the P1 is like most bushwhackers are good. I'm curious. An AC5 LRM. Let's go. Is that three LRM fives? Shows way. And then it has one energy. It's the one energy. Oh, ER large laser. But we don't Here's the I gotta get used to all this ammo and stuff. Extreme. 
extreme range ammo. That's interesting. Well, plus 30%. Nice. Oh, and then there's these are better for uh, VTOLs. That's nice. Alright, it doesn't really look like. Um, Yeah, it doesn't really look like uh, there's anything to really change right now. I would like some more armor, but like it's not awful. Uh, yeah, I think I think we're just gonna leave it like it is. Is this all around the same? 420 and 360. Okay, yeah. All right, we're going to leave it as is. I think we got really, really good mechs. I got to be honest with you. I mean, we got three 55 tonners. I don't think that's normal for a start. I think we lucked out. All right, and now um, you should. Is it mech bay? Storage. How do you actually... Oh, manage task. There we go. So Argo upgrade repaired power core. All right, yeah, I want to do this one first and then do that one. Okay. All right, now we need to look for a mission. Okay, so that is... Here. Always good to see you at Oxford. No, we gotta go to the map first. So, two, navigation. Hello, Commander. The Argo may not be fully functional yet, but All right, she's then we're gonna look for half for full missions. Um, it takes a, it takes a like a good thirty seconds to a minute to uh, actually filter this, and then sometimes after it filters it causes the game to lag out for a little bit and then i have had to because i've uh, so over the last week i have um while we're waiting for this i have played this a little tiny bit and then i've watched some videos to try to you know like so i'm not completely you know like in the dark i'm not far from it i mean don't get me wrong i am not far from it but i'm not completely in the dark all right so where did we go Is the Argos? Uh, messed up. Right, let's go out. How oh, is it going to do that thing? Yeah, it's lagging really bad. I might have to uh, restart it. It's not lagging right this second, so let's go ahead and do the filter again. Yeah, the other reason that I'm doing this series, uh, that I'm well, for a couple reasons, I, I think I've touched on them before. I really do want to play this game, um, and I think it'll be fun to uh, record it and share it. And then, um, but I'm still waiting on a couple of mods. Um, I don't think Solaris, like the the, I think the banter back and forth. I think uh, uh, I think Duncan Fisher was really good. Um, but I just like, I wasn't too crazy about the DLC and it was really short. So I would like to go back to my modded series to record, but I can't until, um, there's a couple of mods. One of them is TT rules. I know there's a few, like, I think you can use it, but there's a few problems where it will crash and I just don't want to take the chance. So I'm going to wait until all these mods uh, finish updating and whatnot. And then there's one other one that I can't think of right now. And then I'm going to start back on my modded series. I was actually thinking about doing, um, I was actually thinking about just starting a new one since we have Solar, the Solar Showdown and a few extra things. And then start later 
so that we can actually run into clan stuff a little sooner. But this is up, so let's let's do this. All right, so we only have. All right, that one's only 28 days away. Or now, what? So when you click on these planets. Oh, that was not it. Okay, so this one's it. So when you click on these planets, it tells you how big they are and like whether or not they have. So if they're like poor and they're small, you're not going to find really good equipment there. So sometimes it's worth going a little bit further um, as long as you're not wasting too much money. All right, and travel 50,000, 33 days. Agriculture, alien, medium. So that's not too bad. Uh, that one's going to be a little bit further. That one. Oh, it's got a black market. Former Star League presence. So that gives you a chance of like uh, buying or finding that stuff. Yeah, we're going to do this. I don't know what that research is. It's World Feature Science Research Institution. Yeah, let's. Uh, it's a, it costs a little bit more to go there, so we're burning twenty five thousand, but I think it's worth it. So I think that's what we're going to do. We're going to travel there. All right, and it should stop when we get to the. Yeah, it should stop. I think. So travel. Go ahead and set course. By your command. All right, um, only four days left for that, 15 days, financial report. Okay, so, okay, good, it does start. All right, so now what we're doing, we're gonna go over to engineering and we're gonna do this. Because we don't, we're not repairing more than one mech right now, so by the time we get there, and uh, do our first mission. When we come out, we're gonna want that other uh, mech bay. But um, for now, like I don't think I think we're good with doing this to go ahead and get our experience going. Sure thing. It'll take a bit, but we'll get it done. All right. I think that was ten days. Uh, so a second. So if I go here, yeah. Or go, yeah, ten days. Okay. So then. Our Wraith is going to come online in 10 days as well. Interfere politics, impact everything, they touch. Okay. I'm not sure what flashpoints are. I know that's the name of one of the, um, uh, one of the uh, DLCs. But other than that, I'm, I'm at a loss. Bailey in the mech bay. You're speaking to Yang in the mech bay when the yelling starts across the bay. A pair of your mech warriors face off in front of a battled mech. You get there just in, just as Hightail pulls back to throw a punch at Sigurd. Oh man, if that was uh. If that was up, we could do that. I don't know if I should see how it resolves or... Hmm. Yeah, we're gonna go, we're gonna... I mean, as long as it doesn't get too bad, right? Hytale punches Sigurd in the face. Sigurd's head snaps back before he recovers his balance and, and charges. Uh, before he recovers his balance and charges. They both tumble to the deck. Hightail suddenly notices you're there. Oh, crap. He rockets to his feet. Commander, we were just, um, crap. Sigurd refuses to meet your gaze. I don't suppose you're going to explain this to me, you say, and the mech warriors remain silent. Fine. One week kitchen labor for each of you. Report to the mess deck after a moment you add on different shifts. Hightail has gained the following tags. Low spear. Oh.
That is sad days. I picked the wrong thing. That's really bad, actually. Man, one day. One day. Couldn't wait one day. Hey, boss. We just completed those upgrades. All right, so now go back to engineering, and we are going to do the McBay. And I think that's 10 days as well. Yeah. All right. I'll get the team on it right away. All right. And then we are still traveling. Travel to, yeah, we got 20 days. Oh, you know what? We could have probably stopped at those planets on the way. That yeah, we don't, we don't really want to spend that much money. Not work, if I may say so. I've got the financial report. So we got to pay that. Which is awesome. Next. So do we want to go up? I think I would like to, just to help out morale. Uh, so each of these white ticks are how many uh, financial reports you can you can make it. Um, so you know what? I'm going to do generous this one, and then we'll see where we're at on the next. Uh, no, I'm going to do. I don't know what to do. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do that. Okay, so that's moving up a little bit. We got to get our morale up up to here, at least. Okay, so we still have ten days travel time, but that means we can do something else what brings you down in engineering. Uh, what do we? All right, that is kind of the extent. Running power through patch together. Drop size. Beta pod, okay. But we don't really need that right now. MRP, drop tonnage. Plus one. Oh, it is plus one tech points. We might do that one. Oh, it's only one day. Yeah, you know what? gonna do that. What? Did I misread that? Oh. That is way too much. Okay, uh, structural repair. some money. Okay, so go back here. Those upgrades you asked for are assigned, Commander. Maybe something that's going to take a little longer and a little less money. Refit harness. Oh yeah. Sure thing. It'll take a bit, but we'll get it done. I have to slow down. Drop information. Ooh, that would have been. Yeah, we'll we'll do that one next. And that that's only. I mean, I say only, but yeah, we'll do that one next. 
So we're almost there. Looks like we've arrived, Commander. What a visitor store. Let's see what you got. What do you got for me? Let's see her. Alright, so store. Oh, it's already answered. Okay, that's one. Uh, weapons. What do we got for weapons? Three. Large laser. Flamer. Okay, ammo. I was told to always buy, have a couple of, uh, couple of these on hand. So we will do four. New equipment available. I don't even know what HVAC is. Is it an air condition? Is it like it blows you up and then pulls you off? I mean, I don't know. Thermal ex Oh, we didn't buy those two things. I really wanted that. Like that UAV thing could have went in a locust. Oh, I'm so mad at myself right now. Academy VTO appointment, mag by UAV beacon, mix. Hold on, I rocket, flamer, large laser, MG. Yeah, they don't really have a whole lot, which is probably good because I'd buy it and then we go bankrupt. All right, so now. I think we can go to the command center and actually pick. All right, so I think what I would like to do. I mean, we're going to be here and do all these. So, yeah, so that's ambush convoy. Battle. Blackout. Defend base. Kind of want to do those first. Chiefs, the local pirate organization. I really don't want to work for them. I'd rather do some stuff for uh, Merrick, but I guess that's not an option with where I went. So we're going to have to move away from here at some point, but for now, that is an escort. Uh, let's do this. We have VIP at the base. Mission from the government. The forces are not in position to come in. We need a team to... Okay. They've got to be kicking themselves for letting VIV go without more security. Their screw up is our payday. Okay, so let's negotiate. And we want salvage, right? See, what I'm not sure of is like, how do you know what you're going to get? So I think what I think we should just do that for now. Yeah, let's do that. All right, and then we're going to drop. Definitely going to bring the bushwhacker. Bring that wraith. Bring this guy, the Apollo. And then do we want to bring the Hermes or the... Okay, so that C that was up there before was that uh, one thing? Was the um, uh, the the C three slave? But I think in order to use that, I think we did the right thing. Okay, so I think I'm going to use the Hermes. It's got plenty of speed for now. All right, and then we want to put Black Walker. I think I want to put the commander in there. Uh, oh, you know what? Hold on. Um, we need to finish. Okay, so. 
London by. I think I want to, for now, just got 4880. I kind of want to. Plus 50% max and sensor range, plus one advanced sensors, plus one initiative. I kind of want to give her this. And then put her in the Apollo. Yeah, I am actually. And then we're going to go with... We're going to go with Tactician. Okay, confirm. And we're going to put Drink her... No, I think that's alright for now, right? Yeah, I think that's good. Uh, actually, you know what? I think over here, it's doing the top corner. No, you know what? Is this thing, this menu is always there? We're going to put me in the bottom left corner. I think that's the where to go. We'll change it if we need to, but for now. Alright, so... Uh, Decker, we definitely want to use. Uh, he's got commander. Orders. So we're going to put... We're just going to up his gunnery and tactics. Yep, confirm. Mech warrior training complete. And then... Hightail. Yep. No, we're not going to use Hightail because he's got low morale. Receiving you. Mando. We weren't going to use... Oh, yeah, I want to use Tok. can probably put Tok... Yeah, let's do talk. So he's got four tactics. You know what? We're just gonna do this for now. Training complete. And then we'll figure it out in a minute. Phoenix. Let's talk. We'll talk out. He had commander too, right? No, he did. All right. So now if we go back to is it command center? Take off your shoes. Make yourself comfortable. So we're going to do the Bushwhacker, the Wraith, Apollo, Hermes, and we are going to put Cherry Bomb in this one. We could have done talk in there. Hmm. Yeah, I think I do want to do talk in there. And then in the Hermes. We want that. Okay. I'm assuming. Yes, my thumb. Okay, so I can't remember. Is higher the initiative better or lower the initiative? I don't remember. Either way, we are the point. All right, so I'm pretty decent at tactical games. But uh, I don't care how good you are. If you're not used to the specific tactical game, uh, then yeah. Then uh, it can be hard. Prepping for combat. Seems like all the loading is a little slow, which is fine. That's not too bad. Begin mission. All systems nominal. Command interface initiated. As we expect, we have multiple incoming pirate units. Hold the base, keep the buildings upright, and eliminate any threats. Okay. 
It's quite sandy out here, out there. Take care not to destabilize your mix. Oh, nice. So there's some coming right there. So they're landing in the water. Alright, so supposedly. So I think what I want to do is. Is it shift? Uh. Have to, we have to land over there. Got it, got it, got it. Alright, that's fine. So, we'll put the bushwhacker over here. Yep. I hope, uh, well, that, hopefully, that does enough. Put the bushwhacker. Uh, actually, you know what? Put the bushwhacker here. Yep. And then that is the bushwhacker, right? Right. And put. How do I tell? Okay, so it's just backwards. Oh, so that does that mean he's landing backwards? So the bushwhacker will go there, and then I think the wraith was next. So we'll put the wraith back. We'll put the actually we'll put the wraith next to the bushwhacker. I want the Apollo up here on high ground, and then Hermes can come over. Hermes over here. This fast movement. Yeah. Get up next to this building. And then. Ah. Oh, okay, so where is
Good to go. All right, so now we're gonna move. Sorry, I, <laughs> I got, I got, wow. I just completely blacked out there for a minute. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, so now, why? Oh, you can't, are you kidding me right now? I kind of want to use uh, her, the Hermes to get in behind. I would have started over here had I known that, but that's fine. And then we're done. And cherry bomb. We're gonna bring over here. I'm really hoping that uh, I'm really hoping we can't, you know, like walk over the buildings that we're protecting. I'm assuming not, but I don't know. All right, so talk. Waiting for orders. I want to. What do we got going on? Heading out. So let's go with this. Engaging target. Hope we can salvage that. Wow. Decker. What's up, boss? I think I want to sprint again. I'm gonna go right here. Using the heat. Well, yeah, we'll target lock on enemy six. All right, that's no what luck. I thought. She's heat neutral, so I'm just taking a shot on the off chance that we get it. Confirmed. Oh wow, yeah, see? Two of the shots hit. That's awesome. Now the engineers are there, so we're gonna get some uh, fire support. All right, and then cherry bomb. We, I think what we're gonna do Just take some of this high ground here. On the move. And then 
Is he on the ground? Yeah, he fell over. That is hilarious. So I think what I want to do is target his legs. Some, uh, one of my LRMs Jan. That's <laughs> that's awesome. Hey. Okay. Alright, that's fine. Barely hit, Commander. That looks like a little train. <laughs> das is super. Alright, well, that dude did not last that long. I gotta be honest with you. We're going to take her over here and try to... I actually would like to leg this guy. We didn't do too bad. Alright, then we're going to take Standing Decker. And actually, you know what? Yeah, we're going to sprint this dude. So. Are there any other units coming in? No? Okay. That's fine with me. Alright, so I'm assuming that these are mines or something. That's the assumption. And done. I need to turn some of these cameras off, I think. I, I don't, like... I think what I'll do is I'll turn all of them off and then, like, put them on one by one to see what they do. Right, so, talk. We're gonna go... Oh, but there's a... All right, so these, I think, are 240, is that right? Uh, yeah, you know what, we're gonna go... Actually, you know what, we're just attacking. Yeah, we're just going to attack with our missiles. No, no. I want to move first. Moving to position. Hopefully I don't move uh, too close. Yeah, there. Oh, I did. Oh, well. Did a little bit of damage. All right, so he's going to get up. You gonna shoot? No way. Here we go. Ch -ch 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 -ch. Oh. I don't think I'm gonna be able to hit him. How do you think? Can you only focus on. Oh, because he was on the ground. Okay. There. Unsettled. Engine crit. Stress. Talk. Commander. Um, uh, are we? Uh, we're probably overkilling, right? Taking the shot. Target eliminated. Well, it didn't blow up, though. 
Alright, now what? Four must survive. Anyway. Right, so far, so good. I don't know exactly what to do right this at this moment, though. I guess just come in. Order. Like, do we have to go somewhere to finish the mission, or are there more people coming in? I don't know. All right. So anyway, let's uh, let's get up here to some high ground. Gonna brace. Are there actually anything coming in? I don't know. Okay. So deadlock. Yes, Commander. We're gonna let's see. We're gonna sprint with you. Get you up here to some high ground as well. Or a little tiny bit higher ground. Higher ground. <laughs> Alright, and then so that's deadlock. Um there you don't have any targets, right? Done. Yes, Commander. Decker. And then if uh can someone sound off and tell me, like, if you play this game, what does reserving actually do? I know there's, there's pluses and minus, minuses uh, to reserving. I'd like to know which. I do not want... Actually, you know what? Let's just get up here. Do that. Copy that. I don't even know why I sprinted. I didn't have to. But do you got to go through your turn or something? Because, like, I don't see any other... Um, I don't see any other... Uh, all right, so we're done. I'm picking up a new sensor trace. All right, there like we go. Enemy reinforcements. All right, fair. All right, I think you can right-click the turn and like, hold it to turn the map. Yes. All right, so they're in the water. So, oh man. Okay, so we got to get over there. Uh, deadlock. Yes, Commander. Is it all of your turns? No. Commander. No. Yes, Commander. Okay, so cherry bomb. Uh, I have some. How many returns do? How long? So do you? Do I have to clear the jam? How long before the jam? Uh... Oh, those were stamps. I want to use that. Okay, there we go. All right, had a little hiccup there. Uh, I'm gonna go. I'm assuming that I can stand on top of that. Moving out. The flee the trooper and a scout. All right, so sixteen point nine. There's no Overwatch, right? I mean, that's actually not bad. You know what? Yeah, let's do it. Oh, wow. I like it. I hit. I'll take it. All right. 
Commander. Deadlock, what are you doing? Where are you at? Pound. Wait a minute, what is that? Is that an enemy? Oh, that is an enemy. Okay, then. So, in that case, I'm there. let's go over here with her. Oh, there's... Oh, wow. So, we're getting attacked on two fronts. Nice. Fair enough. Okay, so, let us... Alright, so she doesn't have anybody she can attack, so we're just going to brace with her. Ruby. No, don't, don't, don't shoot me in the back. The trench. Okay. Houston's holding. Yeah, I gotta turn these cameras off. That's a hover thing. No, don't shoot the building. Oh man, we're gonna lose the building. We're definitely, definitely gonna lose the building. All right, Decker. Commander, what do you got? Are you the one with the? No. Okay, we gotta get you. I want to punch him. I wish I would have uh, put. I wish I would have did put all of those uh, lasers on, so that we could uh, alpha strike. But that'll be all right. We'll do that next time. Um, talk. Yes, commander. Okay, so what do we want to do here? I kind of want to use my ELRMs over here. I think that's. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to fire everything. I want that thing dead. Okay. Heat gauge is redlining. Right. I won't be able to... Um, I won't be able to... Uh, do that again. Seven enemy turn. No, don't shoot the building. Again. Standing by. We want. Man, that thing is not cool, man. Not cool. All right, so we're definitely not going to be able to save all the buildings. Not with that one already at like whatever. 
and that was one strike on it. So, where's my heat at? So my heat's not too bad. So, do we want to fire on that dude again? Take him out from behind without these ER medium lasers and then the medium pulse lasers. Um, but really, these are where my damage are. Let's do this. Damage. You're taking heat damage? I thought... Alright, I must have read that wrong. I need to get him in the damn water. That's what I need to do. Alright, Decker. Alright, this is my fast mech, so... I kind of want to go punch that dummy head... There. All right, I really hope some of this stuff can... Yeah, there's no way we're going to save all the buildings. <laughs> all right, so... attack that dude again. No, we're not. We are not going to do that. We are going to move up right behind them and shoot them with all our lasers. We're going to do one alpha strike and then we'll have to cool down after that. So we got, yeah, we want to shoot with all our stuff. So we want to, I think what I want to do is like this. Yeah. That dude's a little toasty, but, all right, and we gotta focus fire this stuff. Fire and all weapons. Alright, nice. Alright, so that's down. 
we won't like get any salvage from target. it, but you know. <laughs> What are you doing, Cherry Bomb? Alright, so... <sighs> Alright, I kind of want to go ahead and... Like, I know something else will probably take it out, but... But yeah, I just... Spawn a critical hit. Well, he didn't go out. That's sad. That is very sad days. Finish him off. Then. And he does not need that much more damage on him. I should have moved anyway. But just to get around and off that thing. Alright, so Todd, you got heat problems. We are not shooting anything but these guys. So, what do we want to hit? So, you know what? Probably shouldn't do this. Oh man. Oh well. Yeah, that's fine. Target locked in. Okay. I mean, I'll take it. Something good. Waiting for orders. So what do we got left over here? We got that tank right there. And then, is that it? No. Is that a commando? Yeah. All right, so he's got the Hermes. Do we wanna, can we kick him again? Yeah. And I want, oh, yeah. This is what we're gonna do. Oh, oh, heat alert. Engaging. Right. Starting to cook. Gotta shut down. Okay, I gotta figure so I don't understand. Yeah, I don't know. I just don't know. How do you miss that close like just right there. <laughs> okay, so. Do I want to. Melee punch? No, I don't want to do that. I want to. I just want to hit it with everything I got. Confirmed. That was bad. I just got legged. Oh, 
That is sad days. It's because I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing, guys. No idea. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I think I should move. Good to go. How do you unchain? Alright, so I think what I want to do is Sam's, right? No, standard? Yeah, we'll go to Sam. Alright, Sam, let's do it. What is that? Each of Yeah, I gotta learn all this stuff. I have no idea what I'm doing, guys. None. Alright, uh... He's at least damaged. So, we are... Yeah. He got attacked and got negative two evasion. So I gotta I gotta pay attention to stuff like this. Alright, whose turn is it? Oh that dude's definitely gonna be injured. I can't believe I cooked myself. Like I, I don't Fun. Deadlock took it. I know I'm slow, but... Alright, so is this like... Okay, so... Hold on. So, can you not go above this? I thought you could fill the whole bar up, but I guess I'm wrong. should have done is just yeah oh um which one of those had <clears throat> does it show if you have like what kind of evasion and stuff you have guess not i guess it depends on sensors and, sh and stuff like that all right so we're just going to hit the closest one then firing well that was actually i think that was a good hit Target's taken a critical hit. Okay. Right, so we're going to move right here. Moving to position. Oh, it's finally unjammed. Nice. And you are getting, someone's getting a, a full strike. Uh,. Do him. Okay. Inflicted some heavy damage. Yep. I think we actually did a good job on that one. That hit was good. All right, he's moving over there. Where are you going? Why are you? Why are you hiding? 
Well, that's fine. If you can't shoot me, I mean, that's fine. You can hide over there. That means you can't shoot the buildings either. All right, deadlock. Standing by. All right, your heat's fine, so we're gonna, I guess, hit the uh, commando again. Nope, that's not gonna work. So, yeah, let's do this. Affirmative. Fire away! I mean, those weren't bad. Ejected, there you go. I mean, I feel that we actually have a chance to keep all the buildings up. And I know this is taking forever, guys. I'm, uh. But, you know, from what I've seen, a lot of the, um. A lot of these, because the battles take so long. Um, a lot of the episodes for this uh, kind of series are relatively long. So just put it on like one and a half speed and you're good. I think I actually sound better at like one, one and a quarter speed, personally. Alright, so he is unsettled. Oh wow. Pilot, oh, well, I mean, that'll work. Pilot, did it say pilot was unconscious? All right, so. Restart. Or do we just kind of want to sit there? Earth. Pilot is bleeding out three activations remaining. Engine was hit. Okay. He's got first aid. He needs some first aid. He needs some. I don't know if I want to restart it with all that heat. You know what? Done. Stabilizing and bracing. Headlock. Commander. Can I get this stupid commando down? Oh, okay, it's down. So we're going to go this way then. Move order received. Oh, uh, the other thing I'm going to do on uh, what, uh, dirt between now and next uh, episode, um, I'm going to figure out what uh, what I want to call myself. I know that we're I, whatever the the default name was and whatever the default symbol is right here, but that's going to change between now and then, and we'll figure out some colors and all that stuff. So, I guess just the large pulse laser, yeah, and that's definitely not going to hit, right? Oh wow, I hit one. Okay. Yeah, I think I can actually uh, pull this off and not lose any buildings. Oh, I lied. I just lost the building, right? No, eight remain. Okay. Good to uh, right, he's an enemy, right? I think I want to. I want to hit. I want to hit him. He is an enemy, right? I can't tell. Yeah, heavy track. Alright, so... Oh, okay, so if I move over... 
I move over here, I think I'll be able to hit him. That's fine. Fire. I mean, it wasn't the damage that I wanted, but it was more than I thought I'd do. Yeah, I definitely... I, I'm gonna... Between now and uh, next time, we're gonna turn off the cameras. And then we'll figure out which ones uh, we actually want to use. And they are just holding up there. Alright, so I think if that's the case, oh man, I don't think I'm going to be able to. I can hit them. That thing keeps. The same one keeps jamming. ER, ER. And then. That was a lucky shot, guys. And I'll take it. I'll take it. Alright, now who's turning? Oh. Yeah, okay. Oh, now you're coming out. Bring it home. Commander. Hey. Right, we gotta hurry up because he's gonna die. He's got what, two turns left? Waiting for orders. Man, we're gonna lose Decker. We're gonna lose him. I think I'm going to be able to hit anything. Yeah, we'll just brace. Here we go. Yes, Commander. So that, so I think everybody's down except they're for them. So I think what I'm going to do is... A little bit higher ground, maybe. Let me try it again because last time I did that, I got a crit or something. That's going to hurt. Uh, I wish that guy would like. Uh, Am I in range for that? Probably not. I mean, Roger that. I mean, what's the worst to happen? Nothing hits? Yeah. For the critical hit. We gotta get that we gotta get that guy dead. That guy too. Don't take my building out, you son of a waiting right. for orders. Now restart. The heat is frying my internals. Yeah. All right. Ready for action. Hey, are you? Yes, boss. Affirmative. Okay, and we're going to shoot the missiles at him one more time. Copy that. A little bit better. Third thing. 
Vertical hit, Commander. I'm receiving you. Order acknowledged. Yeah, we gotta get their, uh... <laughs> Man, this, like... Okay, see, this is way Fire. better. You're dead. Target's down. Nice, we're done. successful. Okay. <laughs> this is an hour and 45 minute episode. <laughs> This is brought to you by Nightshade. <laughs> I feel like I should be selling something. <laughs> okay, so, and we got, man, we, we racked up 394,000 sea pills. All right. I mean, we're it's gonna definitely going to cost us more than that for that Hermes, which is unfortunate. All right, so contract payment increase by 5,000. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, cool. Next. Uh, so we lost the leg, but I don't think we actually lost any... Yeah, we didn't really lose anything important. So that'll cost something to... Uh, injured... Oh, he's injured for... Yeah, he's not doing anything. That's fine. Alright, uh, I'm sorry. I'm so... Yeah, sorry. I'm sorry, Commander, but Section A, Subsection 3, Perka... As the salvage crew picks over the battlefield, you are contacted by the... They insist the contract terms allows them first rights to the following items. Well... Standard fusion engine, sensor sniper... Oh, man! All right, you may choose to refuse. The dispute of salvage is retained. You lose three rep. Except the dispute of salvage is lost. Exchange items are added to the salvage pool and you gain plus four rep. <sighs> very, very sad right now. All right, so I get to pick three things. Okay, so... Those are just pieces. I don't really want to be mech salvage right now because I don't really know what I'm doing. So, yeah, we're going to skip on that. Uh, I mean, Lee. Alright, so I don't want any smaller mechs, honestly. All right, we'll start from the bottom. So ammo, the streak ammo wouldn't be too bad. Uh, ammo, LRM double, we don't, I mean, maybe. Ammo, fluid oil, structure. What is structure? Uh, turn. So we got the, uh, all right, yeah. Like I gotta learn the game a little bit and that's what we're doing together. We're gonna learn this game and 
some of you that already know how to play, feel free to blast me in the comments uh, because like I know I could have done that a lot better. But I have literally no idea what I'm doing. Well, not true. Um, I got a little bit of idea, just enough to hurt myself. All right, boss, three of your mechs are damaged and the last engagement will cost, oh, want my crew to get started? Yes, I do. That's unfortunate, actually. Okay, that's fine. All right, so um, as long as this episode took, uh, we are gonna go ahead and leave it there and we will come back. Uh, we'll look at those mechs, we'll look uh, at another mission and we'll figure out what we're gonna do from here. So as always, it was great having you with me on the battlefield today. If you enjoyed what you saw, uh, don't forget to leave a thumbs up, a subscribe, and ring that notification bell to stay in the loop for future content. Until then, stay frosty, and I'll catch you in the chaos next episode.